Hey, Snickerdoodles. So this is a video I never wanted to make. I suspected I was going to have to one day. And uh, it came sooner than I had thought. Um, this is just my day. And uh, it's a little circuitous to get there, but I hope it's day. Um, we had to euthanize our bearded dragon today. Um, he, it was time, it was a thing, it wasn't an easy or a fast decision. Um, he was very well loved and cared for. So, I took out, I did, I just hadn't put my teeth in. Um, I, I took my eyelashes off, re -glued them obviously. Um, because I was just sobbing. Straight up saying to him in the car on the way to the vet. So really upset. And on the way back, we stopped at 7-Eleven. And um, this woman had actually flagged me down. And um, she had come across a elderly woman who had injured herself um, while walking. Um, so the second woman stopped and helped her. It's lovely. Second woman forgot her cell phone. First woman couldn't remember who she was or where she lived. And so, uh, the second woman who was lovely, Elizabeth, if you're watching this, you're amazing. Thank you. Um, and so she didn't have her phone. So she asked if we could call, you know, non-emergency. Um, I tried police, fire, and ambulance, and uh, the non-emergency lines were not answered. Um, so someone at 7-Eleven was kind enough to call. Anyway, standing there. I didn't have my mask on. We were outside, and uh, another of the other ladies had their masks on. You know, and we're just chatting. We're talking to her. We're trying to find out what's going on, where we can, you know, help her to get home, if there was someone we could call, we're going through all of these things. Oh, it's 7-Eleven. And, uh, there was a car full of teenagers who, uh, thought it would be really awesome to laugh and make fun of me. And, um, I was really hoping that it wouldn't happen. I really was. I, I knew it would, you know, eventually. I was awful in my 20s, and I have ex-husbands, exes. <laughs> um, you know, and there's always that fear that someone is going to, and I'm sure it will happen, people aren't going to like me. But um, anyone who makes fun of your appearance because you have dentures or because you don't have them in, or even if you're going into dental surgery and you're really embarrassed about your teeth, because I was. That is their problem. That is not your issue. Whatever the reason you had to get dentures, whatever reason you don't have teeth or you have no money to afford dental, um, is not on you. You can literally be having like a thing go on where you're literally trying to help and you're literally doing the best you can in the situation and some people are just going to be buttholes and I just need you all to remember that that says more about them than it does about you and we're really trying to internalize that right now because uh it was a hard one today um I got nothing. But it's not you. I'm gonna go um, smudge my beads before I have a beading circle tonight. Um, maybe smudge myself a little, try and get this off of me, because it's pretty brutal. Have a good afternoon, Snickerdoodles.